Hey YouTube, Halo Guy here. Today I have an update on Halo 5's rotational playlist that will be coming into the game during the month of July. Nothing too crazy for this month, but thought I'd just let you guys know what's happened throughout the month so that you can choose what days you want to play Halo 5 based on what playlists will be available to you. And just remember, when these playlists do go live, they will be featured, meaning they will give out a lot more XP than the regular playlists. So it's a good idea to play these playlists if you're looking to grind out to 152. But without any further ado, let's jump straight into the month of July. July 2nd, we'll be seeing two playlists added into matchmaking. We'll be seeing Halo 3 Classic Throwback. Now this isn't actually going to be going into the social playlist like before. It's actually going to be entering into ranked for the entire month. Which is interesting, we've never seen Halo 3 Classic Throwback enter ranked. And if you guys remember, I think it was May it happened, we actually saw Super Fiesta enter ranked for a month. Which was just weird and insane, but it actually kind of worked in a way. It was quite fun to just grind out Super Fiesta in a competitive environment. So we'll see how Halo 3 Classic Throwback fares in a competitive environment. I feel like it would be a better suit for competitive than Super Fiesta. So there's that. But the second playlist in July 2nd will be a social playlist and it will be Griff Ball, which will be rotating in for Rock and Rail, which I'm very sad to see go because that gives out insane XP after the matches. Guys, I cannot stress this enough. Grind that playlist out, especially grind it out and invite people that do well into your game and get a really good team of four. You can get 10,000 XP for 3 to 4 minute matches, which is insane. As well as winning the games, you will get so much progress towards your Target Master Magnum skins if you haven't already done so. But anyway, back to Griff Ball. You all know what Griff Ball is. It's been a huge thing since Halo 3. You've got hammers and swords, you've got it's basically assault with hammers and swords and a big massive square arena. I'm not a fan of it, especially in Halo 5. I feel like Halo 5 Spartan ability is kind of ruin it. Especially the hammer lunge. I f mm, yeah, I'm not a fan of Griff Ball. Maybe you are, maybe you're not. But they did take it out for low population, so... Doesn't seem like too many other people like it either. But next up, on July 11th, we have yet another two playlists coming in. We have Castle Wars, which will be rotating in for Husky Raid. And if you don't know, Castle Wars is so good. So much better than Griff Ball. In my opinion, it's a similar sort of concept to Griff Ball if you think about it. You've got swords, you've got two big castles, one big straight line, sometimes they make other lanes, but the classic sort of Castle Wars experience is just one lane. You've got Scout Warthog and Mongoose, and it's basically a big massive 8v8 capture the flag with swords, with one straight road. The second playlist on July 11th is of course Warzone Assault, which goes live on the weekend. Warzone Assault comes every month in the middle of the month. Once again, a great playlist for XP, and if you've got a good team, it's also a really good playlist for Target Master skins. July 18th, we see one playlist coming into matchmaking, and it's Covenant Slayer, which rotates in for Griff Ball. I am quite a big fan of Covenant Slayer, and Forerunner Slayer for that matter. I feel like they're a good sort of mix-up from the usual Slayer experiences. If you don't know, Covenant Slayer gives you a Carbine and a Storm Rifle starters, and all of the weapons on a map are replaced with the Covenant counterparts. So a Sniper would have a Beam Rifle, a Rocket Launcher would be a Fuel Rod, a Grenade Launcher might be a Plasma Caster, a Pistol would be a Plasma Pistol? I don't know. Just that sort of idea. Everything's replaced with Covenant weapons. The last two playlists that comes in for July will be coming in on July 25th. And the first one will be Mythic Shorty Snipers, which rotates in for Castle Wars. I love Mythic Shorty Snipers. If you don't know what Mythic Shorty Snipers is, it's Shorty Snipers, but you've got the Oath Sworn Shotgun, which gives you a speed boost, and it has a bit more range and damage than a regular shotgun. But it also gives you the Nornfang Linda Sniper Rifle, which gives you a damage boost, making every shot a one-hit kill, even on the Pinky Toe, which is insane. Insane weapon. Not only that, but the magnetism of that gun is just crazy. Basically, a lot of hip firing, a lot of cheap, easy shots, but do you know what? It's a great casual fun experience, and I love it. The second playlist is another Warzone playlist, which, once again, is Warzone 
Turbo, which will be going live for the weekend, just like at the end of every month. In fact, the time this video goes out, Warzone Turbo for June will be out, so if you are looking to play Warzone Turbo, now is the time. Warzone Turbo, if you somehow don't know, is normal Warzone, except as soon as you clear out your home base from all of the AI enemies, your wreck level goes straight to level 9, so you can just burn out as many wrecks as you want. Not only that, but your wreck battery, or whatever the hell they want to call it, the wreck charge, I don't know what it is, but it recharges so fast, so you can pull out an answer, you know, maybe wait 15 seconds, and you've got enough wreck points to pull out a damage boost free, and you get some insane combos in this playlist. Guys, it is a ton of fun. That's all for me today, guys. Really short video, just going over the Halo 5 rotational playlists for July, before it comes, so you know what playlist will be coming during that month. Leave down in the comments which playlist you're looking forward to the most. Personally, I'm looking forward to Warzone Assault. Classic throwback going into Ranked for the month. I want to give that a try, get my placements in, see if I can hit Onyx, maybe even Champion if I grind it hard enough. And probably Mythic Shotty Snipers. That's always a good fun to play. But yeah, what about you? Let me know down below. But other than that guys, like the video if you enjoyed, it helps the channel out a ton. Subscribe with notifications if you haven't already to stay up to date with all my latest videos as soon as they go live. I'll be covering all Halo news, big or small, so you want to keep up with the channel. I'd like to thank you all for watching till the end, I really appreciate it. I'll see you guys next time, and have a good one.